Hey guys, so it's Sun Saturday. Got back from Toronto last night. I'm back in the studio and we have a special day here. I got a ridiculous lighting setup because I have, I'm fortunate enough to have Dana Mendoza in here in the studio with Francisco. What's up? <laughs> and she won Miss Universe in 2009? Eight. 2007? Eight. 2008, sorry. That's fine. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna be doing some pictures of her today. <laughs> And I did this kind of crazy lighting setup because, I don't know, I felt she deserved it and I think the pictures are gonna be gorgeous. And I'm testing light and here's our first, here's a test shot. Not bad. Unbelievable. And those are just tests because I wanna get the background where I want it, but we're, we're getting there. Anyway, more to come, all right. Okay, so I'm showing more of my setup. Here's the last shot I just took of Diana. Beautiful. I'm doing my video. Here's my, here she is, gonna do another look. Here's my lighting setup, you guys. I added some stuff, took away some stuff, moved some stuff around. I don't know why. I don't have any real reason for it, but um, I just felt like throwing up more lights than before. And the shots are looking like this, so pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. Let's pop through some of these and see how she did. You ready? Here we go. I don't really have to do much with this kind of beauty in front of my camera. Unbelievable. But these are all looking pretty solid to me. Hold on, I got one I want. What? Ah, look at that. That's it. Now we're talking. <laughs> I love that stuff. That's going in my uh, little bit of laughter portfolio. Put that right up, up front of there. All right, good. More later. We'll do more later. I'm psyched. I got her here. She's doing great. Awesome headshots for Miss Universe. Really cool. All right. See you. You guys, look at this. Hold on, how do I get this in here? There we go. Hold that right there. Wait, I gotta focus. Hold that. Hold that. Beautiful. Hold it. Look in there. This is right through my... Amazing. Amazing. Look at this. Amazing. Look at that sucker. Now we're talking. Unbelievable! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Very okay. cool. We're doing another one. Hold it there. Well, why can't I get this? There we go. Ready? You got it? Uh, amazing. Amazing. Go nose that way a little bit. Hold that chin down. Beautiful. Beautiful. Ah! Amazing! Are you having fun? Yes. You are good. <laughs> All right. Fantastic. Look at this. Beautiful. We're doing it, guys. We're doing it. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to discuss this. The lighting's really freaking bright. But I'm going to discuss a little bit about the lighting and what I'm doing and how I'm lighting Diana and why. Uh, basically, I got three Kino flows here. I got... A, uh, a four footer on this side. I got another four footer on this. I got four Kino flows. This is a two footer and another two footer on this side. And then I'm lighting the background with some alien bees. I put pro photo heads on them. And the reason I do is because the, con the contrast out of the, out of the lights contrasts you off those heads. If you look inside compared to the alien bees, you got some little dimples and stuff in here that seems to make the light a little bit contrast here not as flat uh, and, and it, it's it mattered because of the way it hits the white wall and then bounces back over the over the the person um so two alien bees i had a vista beam 600 on the wall because i was going to do a fade so i was going to do a little bit brighter brighter here and then white into a gray but then i bagged that so this thing's sitting back here like this for that reason but i basically just kind of blew it off but i'm I'm shooting, I don't know why I'm pointing these things up. I usually shoot them off to the sides, but I tried it and it worked really well today. So I'm going to 
I'm going to stick with that. Half the things I do, I don't know why, but I do them. Um, I set up some black V flats around her and one on top because the, I don't want the, the light from the background to hit her face. So I wanted to block that coming from, I got all white in here, so I didn't want it to block it from coming up around the ceiling and stuff like that. Anyway, she's in makeup doing her last look here with Francisco. Let's see how beautiful she looks. Let's see if she looks as beautiful in this light as in mine. No way. Hi. Hello. Hi. Last look. Last look. Did you have a good day? I'm about to go home. Yes. Right. It was great. Cool. It was very, very fast. Very, very fast. Quick. Very fast. Yeah, very fast. <laughs> very fast. <laughs> very fast. It's been four hours. <laughs> anyway, so you guys get a sense of how all this, how all this works, and then I shoot on the tripod into the Hasselblad and straight into the straight into the uh, computer where we have some amazing shots of her coming up. Yesterday I was in Toronto. Let's, I got on this computer. So one computer we got Diana. Another computer portrait of Bora Galari um, that I took with a wing behind him. So I'm using Working on that, editing that while I'm doing this. Anyway, it's been a good day and a uh, good couple days. And she's just amazing. Amazing pictures. All right. Till next time. See ya.